A group of students fighting valiantly on a Tuesday afternoon to save lives. Sort of. SPO2 is good. It's a precursor to the real thing. They will soon be the ones climbing aboard Mayo ambulances and responding to 911 calls as Mayo Emergency Medical Technicians, or EMTs. Andrea is an EMT training with Mayo Clinic Ambulance Services. She's fresh out of school, and it all started with a dog. Yes, a dog. But it gave her the idea that she could do this. She could do work that saves lives. And that seems to be a common theme among these students, the wish to help others. Devin is also training. For her, the EMT journey began with a TV show, Night Watch. The show follows the night shift of emergency service workers. The thrill of the work captured her attention, as did the desire to serve others. Something else to take very, very seriously is the shortage of EMTs across the country. During the next 10 years, the industry will need to fill more than 20,000 job openings for both EMTs and paramedics. That's why Mayo Clinic Ambulance Services is trying to get ahead of the problem. Katie is a paramedic and instructor. Mayo Ambulance is actively recruiting students from all walks of life, and once certified, the EMTs transition into a two-week academy program followed by three months of field training, and that's when a career in emergency medicine at Mayo begins. There's a great need for EMTs. Yeah, we're pretty busy. Kate is the operations manager for Mayo Clinic Ambulance, and they're hiring people of all ages from diverse backgrounds. So character-wise, we're looking for self-starters, people with a lot of initiative, people who enjoy, um, you know, something, a, a fast pace, and something that kind of changes every day. All are welcome to check out the industry. High school and college graduates, post-military, retirees, we have other people who this is their retirement gig. They've worked for 40 years at IBM and now they're just looking for ways to give back to their community and kind of help fill their time. Meantime, at the Mayo Ambulance Academy, the intense training continues, preparing for a real crisis, practicing scenario after scenario, though an EMT's work is more than the rigorous medical training. What more can you do for somebody than saving their life? I love helping people. It's also about having a heart. I wanted to be a um, person for the people. The kind of job that ticks all the boxes. Yeah, 100%. Yes. 